Well, Palm Desert could be getting a huge new resort with a massive wave pool planned for, well, frankly, right in the center of town. Yeah, and a Palm Desert couple is now facing the reality, and they're not happy right now with city leaders in Palm Desert. They wrote to us here at KMIR News. Teresa and Nigel Jones say they're upset about the project. They want to know why they and other residents were left in the dark about it for so long. You ask. We investigate our Kitty Alvarado met with a couple today. She's live in Palm Desert tonight with their story. Kitty. This large piece of land is right next to Desert Willow Golf Resort in Palm Desert. It's the proposed site of a multi million dollar hotel and resort. From the plans, it looks absolutely beautiful, but just over those trees is the home of Nigel and Teresa Jones. They say a project this size would ruin their quiet community and it would turn their dream home into a nightmare. It breaks my heart. Teresa Jones says her heart sank when she found out the home she and her husband purchased in Palm Desert just over a year ago may not be the quiet oasis they envisioned. This was our dream home. It wasn't perfect but it had the perfect view and was in the perfect spot. She says after attending a city planning session, she learned about a multi-million dollar resort proposed to be built across from Desert Willow, just on the other side of her yard. And they handed out a brochure and we sat quietly and listened and I absolutely had my hand over my mouth. I was just in terror. She says the nearly 80 acres are zoned residential and after watching the concept video online, she doesn't understand why the proposed Quicksilver Hotel and Resort with over 600 rooms, dozens of residential villas, amphitheater and skate park would even be considered. I never thought Disneyland would come to within 300 feet of my back doorway. It belongs in Las Vegas. It belongs out on the freeway where it's not impacting people's quiet enjoyment of their own homes and investments. Her husband Nigel says the proposed development has been weighing on him too. And if the city had been more open about the project, they would not be in this position. I wake up in the middle of the night thinking, you know, uh, this is not a lot of fun to be here right now. And, and of course, if we would have known this, and it sounds like this has been going on a longer than a year and a half, we would have, as Teresa said, we would have never have bought here. So, yeah, it's a punch in the gut. We reached out to the city of Palm Desert and also to the investor behind the project. The city told us they do take this very seriously. They will sit down tomorrow and let us know where this project stands, and they look forward to sharing that information. As for the investor, we also reached out to them, as we said. They have not called us back. Reporting from Palm Desert, Kitty Alvarado, KMIR News.